Hi everybody, happy Sunday. Now, do you remember the story in the Bible when Jesus had fed the 5,000 people with only five loaves of bread and two fish? Well, after he had finished feeding the 5,000, he told his disciples to get into their boat and go to the other side of the lake. And Jesus was going up into the mountains alone to pray. Now, while the disciples were going to the other side of the lake, their boat came upon high winds and strong, rough waves. The disciples became very afraid that their boat would sink and they'd all be drowned. Then they looked and out in the distance, they saw Jesus coming towards them, but he was walking on the water. When Peter, one of the disciples saw Jesus, he became excited and said to him, Lord, if that's really you, let me walk on the water. Jesus answered Peter and said, come. While Peter climbed over the boat and he started walking, he put one foot on the water and then one more and he was standing. He was walking on the water towards Jesus. Then he began to look around and there was some more wind started to come and he saw a wave coming and he got scared. And he said, help Jesus, save me. Now Jesus reached out his hand and saved Peter. And he said to him, oh, you of little faith, why did you doubt? As long as Peter kept his eyes on Jesus, he was walking on the water. But when he took his eyes off Jesus, he began to sink. Now, as we go through life, there will be storms and not the storms like we had the other day with lots of wind and rain, but just uncertain times. And we're gonna encounter some pretty rough water, okay? Now, as long as we keep our eyes on Jesus and put our trust in him, we'll be okay. But when we take our eyes off of Jesus, we and put our confidence in our own abilities well we will surely sink now i have a little demonstration with a paper clip water and a bottle of doubt by ourselves we can't do the impossible we would sink in the water however if we rest on jesus or have faith in him like the paper clip rests on the holder, he will enable us to do what we never thought we could. We could float, but we also need to be aware of doubt. Just like Peter in the story, once he took his eyes off Jesus, he let doubt and fear invade his mind and he started to sink. And that is faith. Now, faith is trusting in what you can't see because of what you can see.